A man is in jail tonight accused of real life violence against a local man he encountered during a video game. I'm Tanika Hughes. And I'm Ben Becker. John Bachman has the night off. The Nassau County Sheriff's Office says 20 year old Edward Kang beat a man with a hammer and now faces attempted murder charges. Action Jack's Ben Ryan is live. Ben, the sheriff says Kang flew from New Jersey to commit this attack. And Ben, the sheriff said this serves as a reminder of potential real world consequences from online interactions. From New Jersey to Florida to jail. This is a weird one. Some things make you say, hmm. Some things you just can't make up. 20-year-old Edward Kang is a gamer and now an accused criminal. He's facing murder charges after Nassau County Sheriff Bill Leeper said he flew to the Sunshine State and tried to kill a man with a hammer, and it was all over a video game. This is where we live. The two played Arc Age, an online fantasy game. When the suspect was asked why he did what he did, the suspect stated that he is a bad person online, I'm talking about the victim. It's known as a massive multiplayer role-playing game where gaming experts like Mark Ronan say it's an ongoing experience with quests and adventures. People just really enjoy their time spent in the game a lot more than whatever they have going on in real life or yeah, however you're represented in the game, you can kind of be whoever you want to be in a lot of ways. Action News Jax learned the game's services are ending in just three days, according to its website. It's unclear what happened online between the two that led to this, but Sheriff Bill Leeper said that the suspect flew in, then stayed at the Ocean Coast Hotel here in Fernita Beach, and then attacked the victim at his house on Sunday morning. A police report said he went to use the bathroom. When he opened the door, Kang was there and hit him several times with a hammer. Investigators say the victim's dad heard screams for help, and they were able to wrestle Kang to the ground until deputies showed up. Sheriff Leeper said Kang asked how much time he'd spend in jail. Mr. Kang... It's going to be a long time before you play video games again. And the victim has since been released from the hospital. And also, according to Sheriff Bill Lieber, the suspect is currently facing attempted murder charges. And it's possible that those charges could get upgraded. For local coverage, you can